Hello everyone! We continue to explore the features of visual programming using Blockly in Stimulsoft reporting tools. Today I am going to show you how to show a message if a data source isn't available. Open a report and delete data connection. Click the preview to show the report. The report will not be rendered and no one message is displayed. We are improving it. Go to the Home tab. Add a text box with a message to the report. Type some text. We will use the name property to work with the text component. Select the report template area and call the event editor of the rendering event. Select the logic category, tick the if do block, then the equal block. Also, select the objects category and take this block. Add verification to check a data source of the data band. Take the null block. Take this block and type enabled here. After, select the objects category and take the block. Select the data band 1. Define the behavior of the report components if the condition is true. Copy this, take the page block and select the header band 1. Then go to the logic category and take another if do block, the equal block, and take the block from the data category. Add verification, place it to here. check count of the data source. Set the is not equal to. Let's go to the logic category and take the null block and the if do. The equal block and take the block from the data category. Select customers here. And set the is greater than here. Now let's go to the math category and select the block. Go to the logic category and take another if do block, the equal block. Copy this. Set the is not equal to. Add the null. Take this block and type enabled here. Don't forget about the block. And select text 5 here. Define the behavior of the text box with the message if the conditions are true. Click the preview to show the report. The message will not be shown. Delete the data source and click the preview to show the report. The report will not be rendered and the message will be shown. I appreciate your attention. Follow the news on our social networks and subscribe to the video channel. If you still have any questions, leave your comments below or send us a request to support at stimulsoft.com. Stay safe.